funny thing about love is you never really know when it's coming. Hello! Hello! Welcome to a, another YouTube video. My name's Landon Huffman and I'm driving this hunk of shit van and race car up Black Mountain currently. The whole last portion we were wide ass open, foot on the floor. Our speedometer broke, so I'm really not sure how fast we were going, but today we're heading up here to Gallenberg, Tennessee, the Sugarlands Distilling Company. We've got Gilbert, our late model stock car, in tow here, and we've got a uh, car show, show car appearance deal from 12 to 2 out in front of the distillery today and then 12 to 2 tomorrow. So hopefully we make it up here safe. It's a car show this weekend, um, so there's going to be a lot of people up here, but we're going to have a good time, hopefully no issues, and then we're going to drink some alcohol later at the distillery. But thank you guys for clicking on the video, and I'll take you guys with us today. Made a stop the old pilot traveling, Jay. Had to check on uh, Gilbert. All is good. No issues yet. We're about halfway up the mountain. Got about an hour and a half left, so going to be setting those up today. Should have put a decal on the back that said follow me to Sugarlands. Peach. Hey guys, sips up. American Peach, Mark Rogers. It's kind of like peach gummy rings. Or like, uh, peach. So, what do we have, Seth? I got a woohoo. What is that? Peanut butter and yoohoo. Taste that. Peanut butter, sipping cream, and yoohoo. I got a pineapple upside oh, down. Like pineapple upside down. Which was really good at the tasting. All right, we have made it to the eating establishment. Um, after this, we will go drink more. But, but we're about to eat some barbecue mac and cheese, and then we're gonna go watch them play bluegrass. And then we're also gonna debrief. We still have to debrief. All right, we have drank all of our allotted drinks at uh, said distillery, Sugarlands. Two. Seth got X'd out. That means he got cut off. <laughs> hey, you got that cut means, off. That means we left and went and ate supper, and we went back and they figured out what we were doing and gave us <laughs> two free ones. We're going to the arcade. Oh, you got Tommy John. one on this bitch before. I got 1,500. I'm about to get it again. Oh. Oh. Oh my God! I unfortunately did not win the drag plot tonight. So I want this squishy stripe squish stretch ball or baby bottom pop. This thing though, 600. But it, ooh, it feels good. It's like your butt. 
Man, that is $40 worth right there. Let me tell 40 you. 40 hard earned dollars. See, baby bottle pop, green pop, and some shit Brooke picked out. <laughs> I got birthday cake. You got what? Sea salt. Car What'd you get? Chocolate sea salt caramel cheesecake. God dang. Oh my god. It is a foot long. They're hot. All right, sober uh, debrief from day one. We had a little run in with the cop there when we were unloading the car because we were about this much into the road and he didn't like that. Even though we were only there for like five minutes trying to unload. Got the car unloaded and uh, the appearance went well. Hello, Seth. Mark. How we doing? Good. And uh, appearance went well. Afterwards, we had a little fiasco trying to get the car back loaded. The uh, streets of Gatlinburg were absolutely packed yesterday because of the rod run over in Pigeon Forge. So it was just a ton of people everywhere. My anxiety was through the roof. I was afraid that I was going to hit things and crash into things with the trailer, but I did not. Although today is a fresh new day and I could potentially hit something today. Uh, <laughs> hopefully that, hopefully it's me. yeah, hopefully it's, uh, it's not me that hits somebody and it's Seth. Hopefully he hits me. Um, so yeah, we're about to go take the car out for day two and uh, we'll see what happens. Unloading and trailer docking went way better today. Way better. Well, there's less a lot, people. A lot less people in Gatlinburg. Less today. people, but we also had a game plan which made life a little easier. The parking guy did get kind of pissed off, but I think he understood we were going to do it regardless. So, yeah, I think he kind of had a brain about him knowing we can't do this shit with a vehicle that size anywhere else. Yeah. All right, let's go up here to Sugarlands Distilling Company. Also, we got new hats that uh, we will be selling to the public, and I will show you one when we get up to the car. <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah. Trying to move it. Well, it looks like it might put gas in this thing. So. It does. It definitely does. <laughs> it's an all low car. That's right. Hold on, hold on. How you know his name? How you know his name? You're a All right, we've made it back down the hill and we're gonna get loaded up. That was a uh, very successful showing. So now we just gotta get this baby loaded with no issues and out of here. I don't know if there's anything coming beside you, but you straddle these lanes and turn left, be fine. All right, traffic's hell right now on the way down the mountain, but I did say I was gonna show you guys this. So these are the hats that will be available for you guys High Rock Vodka Racing on the front, 75 on the side. They are uh, similar to a Richardson hat, but I believe these are- Outdoor Cap Company, yeah, I think. Outdoor Cap Company, uh, yeah, right there. So very similar to a Richardson, snapback trucker style. These will be available soon on landonhuffman.shop for you guys. I know everybody's been asking, and uh, this is what they're gonna look like. So trying to get down the mountain here, but uh, a bunch of dickheads are going around us on the left side when we got to merge together up here traffic so i'm about to just put the old trailer out in the middle of both lanes and make everybody stop as soon as i heard it i knew what it was i just didn't feel a like fishtail that's why i was hoping it was <laughs> oh man i love our luck yeah, oh no that's a big in there well Thank God it was the front tire. We're literally 35 minutes from home. Came all the way down the mountain and <laughs> the bitch exploded. Damn our bad luck. Um, but it's a good thing it was the front tire because if it was the back tire, it probably would have ended badly. Yeah. 
car guy coming around here. <laughs> oh, you got four way. All right. All right, we go again. We have about 45 minutes. <laughs> For an hour and a half. Yeah. An hour and a half? That's what it said. God dang, dude. All righty, we are back. It's dark in here. We are back and uh, didn't have any more malfunctions. We unloaded the race car and I forgot to do an exit. Uh, outro for the video but thank you guys for watching it was a fun trip <laughs> it, it wasn't without its challenges but we had a lot of fun remember we are back in action next saturday at hickory motor speedway well this saturday today's sunday at hickory motor speedway for the cars tour it'll be a friday saturday thing so i'll have a friday vlog for practice and then i'll vlog obviously the race day as well we'll probably get a test on wednesday i don't know if i'll vlog or not for that let me know in the comments if you want me to vlog our test the last test video didn't do as well but i'll definitely have one shot video this week and then at least two videos at the track so thank you guys again for all the support i really appreciate it and if you haven't already hit the like button subscribe to the channel we're on our way to 20k we're getting closer by the day so thank you guys so much and i will catch you guys in the next video i'm out